The move to AWS was one of, we just needed a better way to do large deployments. Uh, traditionally, we would have to go on site, install, do this training, and the leaders of the company decided, well, we have the ability to run this hardware on a platform that isn't ours, but we have more flexibility, so let's try it. We literally spun up the account in 10 minutes, uh, and it just that was, the, that was the beginning of the end. Initially, there was always one person in charge of AWS because it was such a small part of the business. And then as time went on, it grew to about a third of the business, but we still had one person running everything. So Palo Alto helped us with security and SecOps being the setters and forgetters approach. We've gotten to the, the point now where we have regular security checks and we use, we primarily rely on Palo Alto for that. Being a small company, we can't go become certified in things like ISO. So the next thing is to find something that was, that would give us the ability to say that we're compliant. It helps us tighten security around things. So uh, there may be some new uh, regulation that came out and uh, we need to change security a slightly bit and Palo Alto has been really good in telling us well this thing has not happened you need to fix it. AWS gives us the ability to do compute and run our application and Palo Alto helps us make it secure.